right, welcome back to High Now Daily. Now, when the community comes together, great things can happen. I'm here with Dan Derger, Director of Workforce Innovation at University of Hawaii Community Colleges, and he's here to talk about an amazing partnership that helps people of Hawaii find good quality jobs. Thank you so much for joining me today. Oh, thanks for having me here, Rachel. Absolutely. Now, let's talk about this because I think this is very, very cool. It is a partnership that's bringing in a few different people uh, to support the community, those who may need some jobs, right? Yeah. So let's talk about it. Yeah, that's right. The whole um, initiative is called Good Jobs Hawaii. And what it is is all of the workforce development grants that are managed by the University of Hawaii Community College System, we put them all together in one bucket of money um, and made it easy for people to find it so they can get no cost training for workforce development. So some people are getting new jobs, like maybe it might be their first job, mm -hmm. and other people are upskilling. So they have a job already, but they're learning new skills so they can get hopefully a better job that pays even more money. Very cool. Now, there are four key factors. Tell me about what those are, and um, then we'll go into talking about what, the type of retraining that you folks offer. Yeah, sure. There's four key sectors, industry sectors, that are represented in good jobs. One is healthcare, so jobs in the healthcare industry. Another one is IT, clean energy, and then our newest sector that we're just now bringing on is for creative industries. So people who are interested in creative media or maybe film and television like you here. Um, so those types of jobs. Hey, you could be the next High Now Daily host. <laughs> right, exactly. <laughs> All right, very cool. Okay, so now we're going to talk a little bit about the training because it's free training. Mm -hmm. So you don't have to worry. If you don't have uh, the certain skills that you think you need to have, no problem. You're going to train people and it comes with a whole host of um, services. That's exactly right. So um, it's no cost training for the residents of Hawaii. And there are a, a lot of what we call wraparound services. So those things that are going to help people get through the training as well. So we have a team of navigators who help sign you up and be sure you show up on the first day of training and <laughs> have all of the um, materials that you need to be successful. But then there's other wraparound services for people who maybe have trouble accessing maybe reliable internet. So we would uh, give them a hotspot or they don't have a laptop. So we would provide a laptop for them. So it's not only the training itself, but we provide them with all the materials that they need. Um, if there's any, if it's a, a job like carpentry, we have a pre-carpentry apprenticeship um, program. We would uh, pay for the tools for that person. Wow. So it's way more than just the training that's involved. Absolutely, because a lot of times people might shy away from certain areas or certain jobs because they're like, well, that requires a lot of money that I have to put out that I don't have because exactly. I don't have a job. I need the job, right? Right, exactly. Okay, so you guys are making it easy on that on that front. So now let's talk about uh, some of the jobs that um, fall under this uh, or fall under this program. Sure. I saw that there was like a nurse's aid and you kind of mentioned carpentry. What others are there? Yeah, it's exciting because we do short-term training. So it's anything that's a year or less. So we have some trainings that are even just one day. So you could actually sign up, do a one day training, and now you're qualified for something like a security guard. Or there is a really exciting partnership we have with the city and county of Honolulu that's to prep people to enter the police academy. So to kind of give them a sense of in one day, this is what it takes to be part of the police academy. So that's a really exciting one day training that we have. But then some of the other longer term trainings, like you mentioned in healthcare, there's certified nursing assistant or phlebotomy. Um, in our IT, we have both, most of those are a little bit longer in IT because of the skills, but what's exciting in IT is we have some to upskill people. So if they already have good IT skills, we can get even better ones. So more advanced courses for people like that. So there's beginning courses, there's advanced courses, there's really something for almost everyone. And you said almost everyone because you could be a high school senior or you can be 70 years old and this could be your maybe fifth job, but you've got some skills. Exactly. And you're ready to show them off. Or right? you're 70 and you want to learn new skills. There you yeah, go. Exactly. All right, if people want to get more information, how can they do that? Yeah, our website, goodjobshawaii.org, is the main place to go where you can sign up for the classes, you can see what's being offered, and you can learn more about the program. Awesome. Thank you so much for joining me. Go ahead and check out their website. Um, we're going to take a quick break, and then we'll be right back. Thank you so much. No, thank hey, you. all great information. <laughs> yeah, hopefully.